Okay, after learning about Jim Dine, we're going to work on a card in a heart style like he did his artworks. So you have two options for your card. The opening should be on your right hand if you want it vertical or if you want to go horizontal, then the opening should be at the bottom facing your body. Okay, so I'm going to go vertical and I'm going to make the opening on my right hand. The next step is to draw a heart. So a quick, easy way is to kind of draw a three that looks like it's laying down. If you see, that looks like a three sideways. And then where you want the point, put a little dot at the bottom. And then we're gonna take that three to the point and back up to that other side of the three. So that's our first step. And then you are welcome to use markers, crayons, oil pastels, or color wands. So I'm gonna show you with some color wands here. Take the lid off. And we're just gonna start putting dashes in multiple places, spreading that one color around. And then we're gonna add other colors. You can add as many as you'd like, or you can limit your colors if you want to. Okay, so I have filled up my paper with multiple colors. I did limit it to about five or six. And then the heart is kind of hard to see now, but that's okay. You can use a black marker or a black crayon or a black oil pastel. And then we're going to carefully trace over that heart that we created to start with. And then we are also then gonna take that black and add just a few flicks of the black in those some more white spaces just to have that go together there. Okay, and then the front of the card is finished. Next, we're going to open that up when we're done, and we're gonna write a message inside. Remember, we're sending these to some senior citizens at a nursing home, so I will have some options on the board for you to copy. So here is one example. I said sending you love and joy, and then we're just doing our first name, our room number, and G, whatever grade you are. So you'll come check your pencil with me. If everything looks okay, we're gonna trace it with marker. When you're finished, you'll turn this into the stop sign box for your grade, and then I will deliver those to the nursing home for you.